Okay, so welcome to my latest video. I've not really been doing videos like this very much because I've been, well, the last thing you really saw that I was doing, I was supposed to do videos, was to traveling videos. I've come back over to England and now I'm just trying to make money in every way possible. Honestly, I mean, I'm like driving around on motorbikes in the dark, in the rain, I'm just trying to make money anywhere I can, pretty much. Uh, but I thought I'd start the video with the, I, I bought a watch pretty much. I'm interested in watches. Um, so I got this watch, but the thing is, I've been wearing it. So I've, what I've tried to do is make it look like it's brand new. It's not. Um, but I've just tried to put it back in the packaging to make it look a bit better. I've, I've, I've not got an obsession, but I've now got a. I like my watches and I want a collection of watches. However, I ain't got much money yet. I ain't got the money that I would need to get the watches. So what I thought I'd do is. Get one of these. So this is, you can see, it's called Ralph Christian, and pretty much, it looks a bit like a Richard Milley. And if you look at the other watch I've got, so this is what I mean. I, I can't afford Rolexes or anything. And if I could, it'd be like the cheapest Rolex possible. So like, look how big this is. I've just gone for like the craziest watch I can possibly get. That makes a Rolex Daytona look tiny. I've had Rolex Daytonas on my wrist, and it feels like compared to that but this is the latest collection to the watch collection so the latest addition to the watch collection so yeah i'm not sponsored by them or anything but i do genuinely recommend them they are absolutely like look at that look how sick that is and it, they're like that's like 240 quid like that is brilliant. There's another one I want. It's like a Prague watch, which looks just, just they just make you look like you've got an expensive watch. I tell people it's a Richard Milley when it isn't, and if they don't really know much about watches, just believe me. So, yeah, I bought a watch. Now I need to head out. And what I'm also going to do is show you a car that I've got. Because I bought, I bought a car. I'm not going to tell you what it is yet. If you follow me on Instagram or something, you've probably seen what it is. But, yeah, I'm going to get in the car and go out soon. I'm not showing you out the outside of the car yet, which I probably need to do, but um, yeah, pretty much. I could always drive. People, everyone says you can't drive, can't drive. I always had motorbikes, I could always drive a car. And saying that, you can't even get test dates anymore. Like, it's madness. But pretty much, I don't know whether to actually keep driving this car or get um i want an alfa romeo an alfa's a driver's car I, I, everyone my age you know they get fiestas and, and like see out of beefers and stuff i'm not doing it all right i'm not gonna be that person i want a proper driver's car i want um you know even minis it's a mini in it they're just cool they're just like and they're faster than everything else everyone says oh you got a mini you got a mini what's wrong with a mini they are honestly the faster than most cars that most people have at 18 years old. This one's better, I guarantee it. But I do still like bikes, I do still want motorbikes. I want to get 500cc next year. Um, but, look at these houses, man. Um, but, I don't know, he's warm in a car over when doing it. And everyone used to tell me, oh, you want a car because it's warm. I still prefer bikes. I genuinely still prefer motorbikes. But I love cars as well. We'll stop now. What? We'll stop. Yeah, I'll just get me around this car. back to Bury over the grain road on I, I think it was one of the windiest days of the year I'll actually show the clip now but honestly it was one of the windiest days and um, yeah literally I do not I had to pretty much the only way I can explain it is it was raining 
misty, you couldn't see a thing, there was no street lights. And all I, what I had to do was, over the grey mold, keep up with the person in front to see where the road was going. But when the person in front's got double the grip because they're in a car, and they're flying as well, driving this car like rapid, and I'm trying to keep up on two wheels just to see where the road's going. That's the kind of madness that entails in my life. If it isn't going on in your life, ask yourself why.